This script gives you a brief description of rhythms found in cardiac arrest so that you will promptly recognize and know how to manage when you see them. I am Shamila. I'll take you through cardiac arrest rhythms and its management. Cardiac arrests occur when the rhythms of the heart stops. This condition usually results from the an electrical disturbance in your heart, disrupt its pumping action, stopping blood to flow in your body. Cardiac arrest rhythm can be classified as chokeable rhythm, whereby we have pulseless ventricular tachycardia and ventricular fibrillation, and unshockable rhythm, whereby we have pulseless electrical activity and asystole. Now, let us look on the management of cardiac arrest rhythms. Once you recognize the patient is in cardiac arrest, chest compression and then connect the patient to the monitor is very crucial. If it is shockable rhythm, shock as quickly as possible and resume CPR immediately after shocking. Start with biphasic, 200 joules or monophasic, 360 joules. In pediatric, start with 2 joules per kg. Then continue with CPR for 2 minutes and identify the rhythm. Give IV epinephrine 1 mg each 3 to 5 minutes. If it is refractory rhythm, that is second shock and second minutes of CPR again fails, give IV antiarrhythmic drug. First line is IV amiodarone, 300 mg bolus. Second dose is 150 mg. If it is non shockable rhythm, do CPR for two minutes and identify the rhythm. Give IV epinephrine, one mg each three to five minutes. Thank you for watching.